Uh, yeah, okay, so we've been mostly discussing this on an industrial le uh, level so far. Yeah. Do you see something like this work on a more decentralized home level mining? What do you see? Any yeah, let's talk about really speculative, and, but I think in, in the last exciting, minutes. yeah, a very, potentially very exciting, or the vision's exciting uh, for Bitcoin, whether it's economical as TBD. But imagine what we just discussed, but instead of on an industrial scale, on an individual scale. So some of you in the audience might have solar panels on your home. Um, and <clears throat> imagine a future where tens of millions of people around the world have solar uh, at, their, at their home, and it's actually off the grid, and it's able to do Bitcoin mining in an economical way. Um, if it's economical, the benefits uh, are tremendous. Um, it might be a way for that individual, that homeowner, to take excess energy that's stranded and wouldn't be used for anything else of their, for their needs um, to actually make some money because they could do Bitcoin mining. Uh, the second thing, of course, is that it's, it has very nice privacy features because it would be a very small footprint and it's off the grid. So I think it really helps with both privacy and decentralization aspects of Bitcoin. And it's uh, the most private way to get Bitcoin as well. Through it's mining. also the most private way to, to get Bitcoin. Um, and then uh, an, another, to, another um, software initiative that Square Crypto is involved with is a protocol called Stratum V2. It's just a mining protocol, and that protocol will increase the, the decentralization of mining, and it puts more power, um, it shifts power away from mining pools to individual miners. And so in this long-term future of individual mining with solar at your home, uh, that individual would also be participating directly in transaction selection as well as part of the Bitcoin mining process. So it's very speculative whether the economics would work out for that, but I think it's something we should be talking about as a, as a community and as an ecosystem um, because it has a number of very positive aspects if, if it is economical.